Hey Blockheads, today we're going to be taking a look at Blastoff. He's one of the Combaticons and they forms Bruticus. And he's in the new Transformers Combined Wars lineup. And he is number one of five and, com and combines to form the right arm. So this is a little shot I put him in just to show his posability on there. Uh, he's actually really posable, I like that. The only issue you might come across is any kind of sliding or sitting position just because the width here on the legs. Uh, other than that, like he's he's got some good movement. I like that the art articulation's great. Uh, I'm gonna just adjust him here a little bit and go over some detail. So here we have him just standing here. Got him nice and profiled here on the front. Uh, I've got the wings on the back splayed the way they are just so you can see that. I think it looks pretty good. Uh, also, the posability again just comes into play. The arms coming up and down. Nice socket joints right here. Even the limbs here move. And the waist movement here is really good too, it just pivots on that center point. But it looks good, I like it. Uh, now as far as the chest design goes, the legs, uh, overall I think it's pretty cool, I like it. Uh, I just don't like here on the, the pants, <laughs> that's what I call them, it's got like robotic armored pants. Uh, I can see why they did it as far as matching a little bit of undercarriage when he's in vehicle mode for the jet. Uh, I am glad they put the yellow on there to match the chest on, on the right side, so that does help with that. And just turn them around here. You've got some great markings here. The striping with the purple and the silver on the wings. You get the badges showing on each one. I think that's great. And then you've got the canopy that matches his eyes. Uh, the canopy against that chocolate brown or light brown. Uh, I don't really care too much for that. But if, if it was silver, I would like that more. It also matches the wings right here more. So that's me. Uh, let's see. Also, here... When he's in standing position, this folds up, but when you're going to transform him into the vehicle mode, this folds back for that tail wing here. And speaking of which, I'm going to take the time to transform him and show you his vehicle mode. Last off's jet mode looks pretty good. I like it. It's got a nice profile to it. I do like how the badges really show on all the wings here. Looks good, especially on the tail wing. you got both sides. That's nice. Uh, one of the things I don't care for is... When it comes to the transformation mode and how it's all put in there, mine just will not stick flush together with the rest of the body, no matter how much I push on it. So I don't know if that's just mine or not, or if that's a normal thing. Uh, that looks really good, that profile, I dig that. And I just have him here on a stand just to give you a little bit better idea of what he looks like. Now there's what I was talking about with the pants, but now that he's in jet mode, you can see hides in there just like that so that's pretty cool looks good you could display him either way I still prefer him in his robot mode I think he looks pretty good like that so that looks good so if you get a chance pick this guy up dig him especially being part of the Combaticons I'm really glad that they were releasing that line and let me know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you guys have a good day, Blockheads. Take care and happy hunting.